What's happening Wizfix? It's your boy Wiz, the trainer you can trust. First and foremost, I'd like to apologise for being gone for so long, but I'm back now, 2019, I'm here to help kickstart your year the right way with a brand new bum and legs bodyweight workout. All right, so going forward, the plan is to obviously be delivering to you guys weekly workouts that you can do from home to help along your fitness and health journey. So today we've got four exercises. First one's going to be jumping lunges. The second one is going to be pop squat. We've also got some curtsy lunge pulses and we've also got a normal stance squat pulses. It's going to be done for 45 seconds each with five seconds off or five seconds rest before you go into the next exercise. Obviously with the curtsy lunges, that can't be done 45 seconds each. So we're gonna do that 25 seconds each on each leg and then obviously moving on to the next exercise. You're going to be looking to do this workout for roughly three to four times through, one minute's rest in between. So let's get to the first exercise. Right, so the first exercise we've got here is a pop squat. What you want to be doing here is have your feet shoulder width apart. You want your chest out, you want your back straight and your core tight. As you squat down, you want to come to 90 degrees, keeping your chest up. Make sure you're driving through the heels and not the front of your feet, your toes, to keep the stress off the knees. As you come up, you need to jump out of it. We're going to do a slight twist, go into the toes, and then jump back into a squat. So in real time motion, it would look like this. And then you're going to jump to the other side, down. 45 seconds worth. And then we're going to go to the next exercise. The next one we're going to do is jumping lunges. Very straightforward. Split the feet so that the front foot is flat on the floor, the back foot, uh, foot the toes are on the floor, right? So when you come down, come down, make sure both legs are 90 degrees, stop just before the back leg touches the floor, keep your chest up and your back straight. And you're gonna jump up and then twist, or change leg, rather. We also wanna make sure that obviously when you're doing it, you're keeping your core tight, you're driving through the hills and that when you push through the hills, you're keeping the stress off the knees, all right? So up, down in real time, 45 seconds. Third one, we've got curtsy lunges pulses. So very similar to a normal lunge, but instead of that, you're gonna curtsy round or wrap the foot round. Again, keep the back foot on the toes, front foot flat, driving through the hills. Come down, but we're gonna pulse, so we're not gonna come all the way up, so we're gonna go to roughly around here, mid or halfway up and back down. Keep your core tight, back straight, chest up. 25 seconds, you wanna make sure you really keep your core tight to work on your balance, all right? Then you're gonna switch and change to the other side. All right, and then the final one, squat pulses. We have normal distance. So feet just outside the shoulders, come down, come to 90 degrees, chest up, back straight, core tight, pulse up and down. Again, come around to the halfway point of the squat and back down. So how we're gonna do this is we're gonna go squat into pulse, lunges into pulse, yeah? So it's gonna be normal, pulse, normal, pulse. 45 seconds minus the curtsy lunges, which is gonna be done for 25 seconds each. Five seconds off between each exercise. Again, once you finish the whole round, you then get a minute to two minutes break you repeat the process. Try to aim for four rounds, but if you cap out at three, that's fine. Just keep practicing until you can get to the four. Let's get it. So we're gonna start off with the pop squat. Three, two, one. Again, keep the core tight, get stuck. Five seconds breather. Then we're gonna go straight into 
got pulses. Check it out. Five more seconds, let's go. Ah. break or two minutes if you need it then you start again promise you by the time you finish that third round you're gonna barely be, be able to walk that's how I feel after round one so you already know it's a burner Woo. so that was the first one I've done the first round with you now let's so go off and complete another two to three more if you like the video you like the workout Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Follow us on all the, all the socials, don't be shy. DM me, message me on Facebook, send me an email. If you've got any, if you've been following us for a while and you've made progress, you've got pictures to show, send them in. I'll repost them on the Instagram page, the Facebook page. Let's interact. All right, until next time, guys, more fit. More life, get with it.